and welcome back. So we are continuing on with Minecraft Story Mode. And we're kind of trapped down here. So what does this lever do? Okay, we've got a lever. I bet it's connected to the hundreds of sandbox up there. One cave in coming up. Okay. That should do the trick. Let's see about this secret lab. I just hope whatever's there can help us. Yep. It will make helping Petra and Lucas a lot easier if there's something useful at this secret lab. Yeah. Palmer's completely ruined the word useful for me now. I'll go anywhere, do anything, and work with anyone as long as it helps Petra and Lucas. Really? You're a good friend, Jesse. I must say that woman has been a most intriguing person so far. I am still not entirely sure what to make of her. Granted, her creation nearly ended up destroying this world, but considering my own history, I'm inclined to give her the benefit of the doubt. Hey, she definitely helped us out of a tight spot. That makes her cool in my book. True. If she hadn't stepped in when she did, we wouldn't even be having this conversation. I wouldn't mind getting to know her better. Hey, I... Happy to hear you giving credit where credit's due. What did you hear? It was nothing. Uh-huh. <laughs> Lawn guy calls you Jesse, right? Yeah. And this is Ivor. Our friends who we left back there are Petra and Lucas. And you are... You can call me Harper. You could also explain why you led Palmer's forces right to my secret lab. Seems to me I've got a whole lot of angry computer-controlled monsters out there waiting to tear some new holes in my lab. It's not my favorite. Yeah, that one's my bad. Sorry about that. Uh-huh. I'll be sure to use that sorry for protection when that crazy computer is knocking on my door. What are you doing in this world anyway? You here to try to steal my secrets? No. No. Just figured I'd ask. Better safe than sorry and all that. <laughs> Bunch of you are the first people I've seen come out of the portal network in forever. So you have to excuse me if it made me a little anxious. You've been spying on us or something? No, I just know where the portal network spits people out, and I've never seen you before, so logic. You know that much about how this portal network operates? I should think so. I helped build the dang thing. But that what? would make you an old builder. <laughs> Forgot you people called us that. Never was my favorite name. Makes me sound like some sort of living statue. I just, I can't believe it. Well, if you're an old builder, can't you help my friends get free of Palma? I'm afraid that's a little out of my abilities right now. Palma's just too powerful. And besides, there's actually no exit portal back to the portal network from this world. What? Why not? I destroyed it so that Palma couldn't get free. It was impulsive, but it was the only way I could think of to make sure Palma didn't try and spread to other worlds. Keep trying to make things useful. Okay, well, that's fine. Can't you just build another one? You basic or something? I can't do that while Palma's still running. So, Palma, what is it? I swear, I made Palma with good intentions. It was designed to automate things, make everything more efficient, use monsters to help with farming or mining. Until the day Palma decided that the townspeople weren't efficient enough already. Started making them useful. Perfect. That was a long time ago. Since then, I've just been trying to stay one step ahead, figure out how to stop it. When we were back in town, Palma seemed to really want to capture you. What was up with that? When Palma chips someone, everything that person knows gets absorbed into its database. If I got chipped, Palma would know how to build an exit portal. So you can see why I'd want to stop that from happening at any cost. Yeah. Yes. That is quite the extraordinary risk. So what you're telling me is that your brain is super dangerous and can't go anywhere near Palma. How are you supposed to help us with any of this? I do think I can help you with, with Palma, your friends, getting out of here. But to do it, we're going to need to go to my lab. What's in your lab? It's complicated. What do you mean it's complicated? Before we head inside, we better get my defense system going. Don't want those chipped up creeps following us in. Grab my bucket for me. Ron's got it. 
Ron. Hello, Brain Harper. I am happy to see you, my friend. Really? Harper. Hey, don't you judge me. Being alone gets lonely. Yeah, I guess. Happy to help, friend. Thanks. See, I needed a way to confuse Palma in case it ever found a way down here. That's why all this is way more complicated than it needs to be. Wow, what a builder. Make sure you don't drool on my floor now. I don't know. I'm starting to think that you just like complicated machines. Watch yourself there, newbie. Don't know if you know this, but water is kind of Palma's weakness. Yes, we had figured it out, actually. Once Palma caught on to its weakness to water, it started eliminating as much of this world's water as it could find. This water down here, it might be all that's left. Oh no! I still need to activate the other cauldrons! Hold them off to buy me more time! Are you serious? You do, don't get caught. I'm not about to get left alone again. You could have made this much easier for yourself. It is useless to defy us. You only delay the inevitable. Come on, Petra, snap out of it. It's me. There is no Petra, only Fama. Don't do this, Petra, please. I know all your moves now, Jesse. Why even bother fighting? Petra, please. You have to. Oh. Bam! Uh, Lucas, let's try and fuck this out! The time for talking is over! Great. Okay. Harper and Lucas? Darn it. Jesse, I, I, I'm, I'm sort of remembering something from when I was chipped that seemed very important to Pama. Tall, glowing red lights, but I... I I can't quite make out what they are. It's like a fuzzy dream, kind of, kind of giving me a headache, but I, I can try to remember it more clearly if you need me to. It was so strange. Hmm. Sharing other people's senses and thoughts and memories at the same time. Just take it easy for a minute. After what you went through, you could probably use some rest. <sighs> Thanks, Jesse. You bet. Okay. We may be down, but we're not out. Harper told us to find her headset thing. We just have to find whatever it is before Palma chips Harper and starts downloading her mind. What's so important about this Harper person? She may have come across like just another weirdo, but she's actually an old builder. She built the portal network, which hopefully means she can help us get home. 
That's a pretty good reason to rescue somebody. We're going yeah. to work with her to shut Palma down, save her people, and what? that will hopefully free Lucas too. Whoa. Yeah, whoa. Before she was abducted, Harper gave me this. She told me to give it to someone named Harry. And that would find this headset thing? That's what she said, Jesse. Are you sure Harper hasn't, you know, completely lost it? When people are by themselves for a really long time, it's bad for their health. It does look like she's lost her way a bit. And found it again. Leading right to Crazy Town. Watch your tone. She is a genius and should be treated as such. Although, even I have to admit this is a bit much. <laughs> She may have built this place a little weird, but I guess we shouldn't judge her too harshly. Especially when we need her help to save everyone who's been chipped by Palma. Good point. Right now, we need to focus on finding the headset. For starters, let's see if we can figure out who Harry is and why he wants flowers. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. They look so happy. Prototype. Autonomous management agent. What? Huh. So that's what Palma means. Oh. Little weird. It's Margaret. So good to see you. Hope you've been well. You've got to melt that ice around your heart and forgive yourself. You're not the one to blame. Oh, okay. What? So, having the right item in the frame activates the circuit. Neat. Okay, let's find... So, what do you think of Harper's lab? I'm highly impressed. Although that painting does make me sad. Look how happy they used to look together. Yeah, now, now they're trying to kill each other. What? Okay, basically the uh, flower doesn't go in here. Thanks for saving me back there, Jesse. I know with both me and Lucas chipped, it can't have been an easy decision. I don't know what I would have done in your position. And we're still going to save Lucas. Don't you worry about that. I'll try not to. You better not. Okay, moving on. Uh, nothing here. These might come in handy. Awesome. Okay. Crafting table, just what I was looking for. One Ooh. redstone torch, and hopefully one step closer to getting that headset. Good morning, Harper. 
It is Harry. It is always so good to see you. You should not let yourself feel guilty. You have the best of intentions. You are like a flower in the desert and bring joy to those who have none. Okay. This must be Harry. Okay, making progress. Yep. Yay, we did it! Something. That did the trick. This must be Harper's headset. Do we even know what this is supposed to do? I know you feel pretty confident that Harper's one of the good guys now, but... I just want to make sure that putting on an electronic device built by the same person who built that monster machine is worth the risk. Whatever it does, we're going to use it to defeat Palma and free everyone under its power. Not 100% sure how, but we will. Woo! Go team! Well, let's put them on. Here we go. I'm starting to see something. What are you seeing? Is Palma there? Or more monsters? I'm not in the lab. I'm outside. What? I'm... I'm at the base of a giant mesa from the looks of it. It's like some sort of mob view or something. What a preposterous name. I love it. Wow. I wish you guys could see how cool this is. So cool. Remarkable. How is this possible? I mean, I've always heard tales of what the old builders were capable of. But this, this is just remarkable. I'm sure you'll figure it out, but my guess is... It's like this headset lets me control things that are hooked into Palma. Unbelievable. There are so many questions I want to ask Harper. It's a shame she was captured. That spider jockey had to haul Harper all the way back to town. You traveled there instantly. I'm Harper's only shot at getting out of this with her brain intact. Let's hope she isn't too far away from this zombie you're controlling. They must be taking Harper to where they put those redstone mind control chips on Lucas and Petra's heads. So that's where I should go first. I remember there being a stairway here, though. You mean it's been removed? I guess visitors aren't being encouraged. Hmm. I would suggest building a tower up there, but that's not going to help you get back down once you freed Harper and Lucas. Yeah, you're right. Sand. Not the most exciting material. But I can still craft with it. Huh, clay. Unfortunately, I can't get it without a pickaxe, so it's pretty much useless. Everywhere. Alright, so I'm just gonna end this episode here, not to make it too long, and I'll see you guys in the next part of this episode. Bye bye.